B-52s are required to have more than 30 liters of liquid oxygen. Without this, the pilots wouldn't be able to breathe while in flight. The fuels facility airmen go through a series of procedures to ensure the liquid oxygen is ready to go for each flight. First, they start by making sure the oxygen carts don't have any leaks or broken hoses and are in good condition. Uh, we come out here and make sure these 50 gallon carts are good to go and then we suit up and we walk over here to our 6,000 gallon tanks and fill them up and we take a 200 milliliter sample and then we take our 200 milliliter sample and once that burns off then we take an odor and sediment test and once that passes we write it up that we filled it in its log and then we park it out here and it's good to go. These airmen fill the oxygen carts twice a day as long as there are two or more carts to fill. They must wear protective gear while doing these procedures to avoid getting burned. A LOX is very cold and if it touches your skin it burns so you have to wear protective clothing so if it was to splash on you, it wouldn't burn you. It boils at negative 297 degrees. My job's important because pilots need this oxygen to breathe on board while they're in flight, and without it, they wouldn't be able to fly. I'm Airman First Class Tori Groschick, Barksdale Air Force Base, Louisiana.